Hello, this is Michelle Knight. This is the Astrological Update for Pisces for the week starting the 17th of October. This week is very good for you when it comes to your career. You And it's very important actually how you look when it comes to anything that you're doing because the spotlight is on you. Now, I'm not talking about the way you look in a superficial way. If you want to work, walk around in a mermaid outfit with a pom-pom on your head, knock yourself out. That's your unique style. But if you like to dress as a mermaid with a pom-pom on your head, don't be caught out and about in a three-piece suit. Equally, if you need for your profession and energetically to appear a certain way, make the effort this week to look your best and feel fantastic in whatever way that is. Because people are watching you and you have great opportunity. And also what you put out there, people are seeing. You know what, these days with the web and everything, we put out a shoddy bit of work, you know, that's lying around for eternity so just be careful with the way things look this week on the 20th it's quite an intense day for all of us with mercury opposing uranus and mars and pluto conjunct it's all about your reputation actually and how other people see you so again it's about being observed and how you behave and you know what your morals are and what your you know what energy you're putting out there of course this could be something that ends up being in your benefit but it means taking care um, and don't do something that could, would be deemed irresponsible or you know flaky because other people are like oh okay and there's particularly when it comes to being in a group or when you're networking because you have the opportunity in fact ironically it could work the other way you could put something out there today or on, not today on the 20th and it could go viral you know, it's about extreme situations involving groups of people. Now, on and there's also Cardinal Grand Cross with Uranus Eris conjuncting and squaring the moon and blah, blah, blah. And it's all like, rah, we're being pushed and pulled in many different directions. But there's a part of you committed to your own happiness. And, you know, your happiness is about doing everything that you do with a creative and loving touch. And if you stick to those principles, you should be fine. Finally, the sun is shifting signs and making you more adventurous. Don't be too risky, but do study, travel, talk to people who are unusual to feed your soul in the coming weeks. Take care, gorgeous, and I'll speak to you soon. Thanks for listening, and please, if you haven't yet, it'd be great if you could subscribe, share, like, or comment. Take care, see you next week.